Bretton Cameron, the captain, back to the middle for Greenville, but Wade Epp controls for South Carolina. Kelly Zajac out to Bois. Du Bois right wing, he shoots and scores! Derek Du Bois, his first shot back, and he fires it top shelf over Jeff Malcolm. One nothing South Carolina. How about that for a return? The fans could not be more happy to see him in the lineup, and that is why. If anybody had a leftover teddy bear, they might have thought about tossing it, but all 6,000 of them went down on the ice last night. Here's another chance at the boys again! Off the faceoff, Derek Du Bois. His first two shots of the year have found the twine. And South Carolina leads it 2 0, three minutes in. Here's a tip for Greenville. You might want to cover Derek Du Bois. Off the far side, stays in play. Weinstein now loses it and trying to get control. It's Zanette for Greenville. Back at full strength. De Silva a shot and he scores. Went off the glove of Parker Milner. And Greenville gets a man out of the box and gets on the board. Bergen holds on the puck. Playing defense here early on for Greenville. Stingrays coming on side. McParlin with a lot of speed. McParlin to the net. It's followed up and it's in. The official has not said anything yet. The puck is in the back of the net. We're going to have a review. The puck was driven in the net by McParlin. McParlin lost it. And actually, I don't even know if that hit the stick of Gasick. It is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle night. And with that, there's a pizza eating contest on the ice right now. This is intense. The pizza eating contest. Who can eat a CC's pizza as quick as possible? They got and uh, you know, I gotta love it. The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle night that they're going with the pizza contest. That's all the turtles do is eat the pizza. As they say, cowabunga for the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. We got a lot to talk about here after 20 minutes. Zane Jack now for South Carolina with 19 points on the season with 15 assists. Du Bois, of course, goal number one and number two. Joe Devin, a huge lead. It was two to nothing early on. But Justin De Silva got Greenville back. In the air, Gasek just followed the play and knocked it home. And they decided, yes, that's a good goal for Alex Gasek and the Stingrays. Gasek seventh of the year. Stingrays have a three to one lead. Stingrays scored on three of their nine shots in the first period. And now the Rays turn it over behind the net, bounced off of Zane Jack's skate. And a two on one for Greenville. Cameron brings it in. He's chanced for the front, it was blocked. Another shot, and it's a goal for Greenville. It got past Milner in front. Wade Epp is upset. Trying to talk to the officials. They've called it a goal on the ice here. On the two on one for Greenville, they threw it to the front, it bounced off of Epp, and it got behind Milner, he covered it up. Off the far side, got Joe Devin, and he starts the rush for Bois. Derek Bois into the zone, Bois Right circle, centering pass, Joe Devin, Zajac puts it home! Kelly Zajac gives the Stingrays a four to two lead with seven minutes to go in the second period. Great puck movement, Du Bois got it over to Devin who hit Zajac in front for the redirect home. Played in the near half wall, Marganeri got it down low to the corner. And back to McParlin on the half wall. Over to Weinstein, a shot, score! Weinstein the shot, the screen in front. And it's a power play goal for South Carolina. That will end the power play. There was just 1.32 to go. Greenville to the goal. Dylan Marganeri is third of the year with assists by Steve Weinstein, his ninth helper of the year. Power play, Stingrays keep the same unit on. Brooks back into the zone. Du Bois, right circle, shoots, deflection. Devin in front, score! Rob Flick with the backhand. Power play goal, South Carolina. They lead it six to two, Rob Flick. On the backhand, top shelf. Behind the net, John Parker. Parker on the near side half wall. Leaves it for Perrier. Down the wall in front of Marganeri. McParlin back to Marganeri. He wraps it around and scores. It's still in Marganeri again. His fourth goal of the season all against Greenville. Second of the night. 
and Parker will pick up the first assist. That's the highest output of the season. Seven goals for South Carolina. Pass, Gulak has shot in, but couldn't control. And it's brought on the near side by Greenville. Flick gets the turnover to John Parker. Parker on the near half wall, keeps it alive for Marganeri. Marganeri in front, Flick deflects it in. 8-2 South Carolina. Rob Flick, the latest man to get two tonight. Final seconds, fans counting it down. With their highest offensive output of the year, South Carolina defeats Greenville by a final score of eight to two here at the North Charleston Coliseum.